yo, like, I was scared to shit. Like, how did you know? How did you know it would work? Because I believe in what's real. No matter how many mistakes and disappointments it delivers. Well, your plan threw us for a whirlwind, but you know what? Either way, wherever your judgment was at, it worked. Well, for me, the way I envisioned the plan was to feel as an emphasis to side away all masks and hide silences to seek out experiences. The most important way to do that is to feel, whether it be pain or even fear. To feel is to elevate, to evolve, to determine the next phase of anything. That's some serious psychology behind that, Rachel. Look, Sienna, I've been doing this for a long time. For as long as I can remember. Smallest, simple, fatal, graves. Each mistake has a natural perspective which has shared a unique experience with me for as long as I have lived what I have been through. See, I may not have perfected my craft, but my game has gotten better because of them. As disciples, I guess we really have much to learn. Well, I am certainly not Reyna, and I definitely don't look at you as disciples, nor even protégés. What I am doing is offering you both hopefully a better vision on how to be about in this world, with the option to keep what Reyna taught you both as an open mind also. See no more. I'm in. You stronger than the Black Spear. You could have killed Reyna a long time ago. And you can still defeat her if you wanted to. What kind of person would that make me if I did? I'm in, but I still got my way of doing things though. I'm sure it won't be a problem. Alright. What the heck is this? Hey! You two, the nerd. What the hell was that back there? Babe, I can explain everything. Explain? Wait, you knew? It was my plan to be goggled. What do you mean, your plan? We got you, Rachel. You don't have to testify. So what you doing that rogue piece again? It's called help, Tony. Something you obviously have no problem turning down. Hell yeah, when it's behind my back, that's why I don't need it. Whatever you ladies have going on here could have compromised our entire mission. Excuse me, but us ladies put our lives on the line as much as you all did. Oh, so two wrongs make a right with a fake and a knife. Obviously you got the job done, right? Don't you dare try to justify these type of events with those kind of means. I ain't trying to justify nothing! You know what, Ricardo? This is what I'm talking about. Huh? This. I don't know if you've noticed, but while we were being pulverized out there, we could have died. That's why I called Zaka. Behind my back, which is why I planned this surprise. We were going in circles because you were too hesitant. When I don't know what you're talking about. You're too perfect, Ricardo. After all these years, you still lack, but you have yet to learn. Oh, so you're ahead of the curve now. If this team is going to survive, then the decision I made today was an excellence of itself. Excellence? I met up with Sienna and Rattle privately, separately in between our gear checks and plans. I told them what to do. Yes, they were a bit hesitant at first. Then they were able to adjust. Adjust? Rachel, I could have killed them! Sienna, I could have killed you! Rattle, I could have killed you! Your genetic powers could have stopped me, considering both your histories? For that matter, Rachel, baby, I could have killed you! I don't know what the heck is going on. If there's shit behind my back, how am I supposed to know what to do what we're dealing with? Trust, Ricardo. Trust? As you stand there and look me straight in the eyes and you talk about trust after a stunt like that? That is what trust is, Ricardo. How many knives in the back you can stand, survive, and forgive? Because that is all this will give the longer we play this game. The readiness, the preparation, is just denial. Denial from what? Humiliation, defeat, and the long-lasting shame that it will come with. So using my girl as a way to teach me a lesson about learning hard. Tony, we can't just cover shit up with positivity and pep talks. Nah, that's right, because we gotta be real honest and accountable, and I sure as hell lost count the number of times we done crossed that thin line between hell and pain. That thin line was the only thing that kept us alive and kept us both side by side. Yeah, but I ain't had that many shot calls, Sienna, because saying that I felt powerless is actually worse than the way I felt. But I guess a spy knows a thing or more about exploitation. You didn't think I felt humiliated and powerless too? There were times where I wasn't the only one who did nothing. And that's why I made this choice. Because this has already fallen apart. But how do you piece a thousand losses back together after a mistake? By the eleven of us here and the mistake that isn't the only one yet. 
You saying we're not good enough? I'm saying this is what a team looks like. A unit, a mistake, errors, humiliation, shame. Vulnerable together assembled as one no matter the reason of logic. This is trust. She's right, Ricardo. We may be afraid. But we trust our lives in each other's hands regardless of where we stand on faith. And we forgive each other and ourselves no matter the trials and errors. You taught us that, remember? You did, Ricardo. I did. And you did get Rectomancer. We got Rectomancer together. And we did have help too, to say the least. I want everyone to listen. I am proud of everyone here today, and I look forward to what we will all continue together down the line. Some of you I misjudged, and some, I have to admit, I was impressed by. But make no mistake, we are a unit and a team. I say we push this to the next level. So what about Rectomancer? I mean, we got him. He's sitting in the back. Your call. The team is restrained. He'll be out of commission for a while. Sorry about that back there. No, don't apologize. Your emotions were justified. Not much that I didn't defend them back then and there. Rachel, I'm not gonna lie to you. I'm gonna be honest with you. For the first time, I thought we were all gonna die out there today. I did too. And it hit me. As much as we got the new kids, and as far as we're going with this, we're getting too old for this, aren't we? Yes, we are. And they say education never gets old. And the forces of evil doesn't either. Which is why we run spite. Ricardo, Rachel. What is it, Jeff? The Predestar. Derosis? Ricardo. With the Predestar hovering above us behind you and Saran, something tells me this visit is... somewhat formal. If there's someone more secluded, we can engage in an urgent discussion regarding an imperative matter. My ship, right this way. So may we ask what this is about? Correct him not, sir. What about him? You have him correct. This is correct. What is this about? I have orders from the current decom to retrieve the Sokolo, President of his Rector, and to you decom custody while you will await deliberation. What? Yo, hold up! Yo, seriously? Wait a minute, in case you didn't know, like... I know this is very confusing to estimate, but let me... Are you sure everyone on this ship? Hmm? Ricardo, I know this is difficult. No, it's really not that difficult at all. Because I see what's going on here. We have the most dangerous Sokolo in our possession. Zellior believes we can make a great gesture by flashing a warrant presentation in the form of Sakat Decom Diplomatic BS out of convenience. Our relationship is still intact. We continue to uphold our respect for you and your operation. I don't think we are on the same page because never in my wildest dreams could I have ever imagined that you would be full of crap! Let alone be spitting in our faces! You know how this works, Ricardo. No, I don't. Because the car doesn't work this way! I'm afraid it does not, Ricardo. No, it doesn't! This is more Zellior Praetorian authoritative piss! Because since he was given the keys to the Ivory Mountain, he certainly can take a dozen kingdoms and turn them into a billion towers. By appealing to the classes of prestige and appropriated professionalism, he can approve his comfort on his phony throne! Your aggressive suggestions are escalating a nerve and in a line that is disturbing any type of rational. Rational of footing sell your face. Me, my wife, our comrades, we almost died today. We survived the most bloodiest war zone we ever took part in, so excuse me if I take offense if you play interpreter because Zellior thinks it's okay to live convenient. Zellior gave the command, I am carrying out the order. No, the only reason you are alive and breathing is because of what we sacrificed. Because if you're dead, dead against someone you thought was your friend who stabbed you in the back because he was only there to spy on you. When he was really getting intel on how to train an army of bigots. Bigots we put down and out of their misery. So don't you come in our ship making demands. Rectomancer is our problem. Not yours, not DCOM, and certainly not sell yours. Rectomancer is the most dangerous war criminal alive. He must be processed to the fullest extent. I don't believe you heard what I said. No, I believe you heard me correctly, you can't go from day. 
Zelior Cyberdead. This is an obstruction in terms of entitlement. Zelior, Saka, they don't even like you personally. And reality doesn't like either of you. Why the hell do you think I'm still in this business? Why the hell do you think I am still in this game? Because we are fighting for what little bit of sense justice has left! What small bit of decency reality is losing! Then cease any form of defiance, Ricardo. To please Zelior, I never thought you'd lose complex courage, but you wanna railroad me about the handbook. Piss on me about treason! Praetorian BS! But I guess near death can quote cowardice in the form of grateful appreciation. I've heard enough of this. Rachel Angeles, Ricardo Day. And Jeff Blendon, you will release Rectomancer into our custody right now! On whose authority? Mine! Try me, Rachel. Whoa, we are on the same side. Now, nah, protocol is different, Rachel. They washed in! Okay, Rectomancer slipped a bomb into a black kid's backpack, blew him up to pieces. Plus, Russell Crane has been framed for murder, and you better believe Rectomancer knows exactly what's going on. So, with all due respect, uh, it's been a long day, if not a long year that feels like more than one, so... If you don't release the captive, we will be forced to order the Predestar to obliterate everyone on this ship and the ship itself. You are outgunned, outnumbered, and you may be resilient, but all of you are exhausted and a very small piece. We can and will squash you, underestimate us, and we will send your wretched asses to oblivion. If you want to test me, go ahead! Okay, you know that was a threat, right? Nah, she the type of pink that'll carry it out. For once, a snake bite is right on target. You're dead serious. They're not bluffing. No, they're not. Wait, you ain't serious about going along with this, is you? Yo, Tony, they got us on the hooks. We ain't got the numbers, bruh. Got us on the hooks? No! Ricardo, we got a plan, right? Because we ain't finna let this happen. Tony. Tony. No, nah, this is out of order, yo. They come up in here threatening us when it was us who smashed up the most money with no help. Zakai helped you. Nah, it was the Zakai Autonomous Guerrilla Warfare Army. Trail, Tell, Sack, Drotest, and a whole lot of on calls. Not you, not Zellior, not the Predestar, and certainly not Decom. We was out there being lambs to the slaughter, almost devastated at this rate. Now y'all being down here kicking regulations. We seize Rectomancer. Not y'all. Even Trump will testify. Even Trump will even tell you. Even Trump can now can't even stand you. I agree with Tony. I agree with Tony as well. The decom system is. The decom system is what? Corrupt as any other system operating in these institutions running? Corpses code 1Z for us. Oh, it suck. Wait, what? He just invited us on board the Predestar. Those are security clearances. Cosmic. Distant. But I don't understand also. Despite the intensity level of our current predicament, I would hate for these. Current procedures to jeopardize our relationship. You will be given access to a cell. I would even advocate that you all oversee his interrogation. Done. Wait! We're going to the Predestar. We will escort this ship and I have a spot for this vessel to dock. This is a dangerous risk, Derosis. Decom will not go for it. No, I don't expect them to. But Sakaar is near extinction. This cannot be the only direction it can go. Derosis, we had him in the back inhibited. We can conduct this here. You can even supervise. Turning down an opportunity of endeavor. No, what I'm saying is, we fought on the front lines of a lot, and we both were there when we first sent the Predestar off into the sky. He fractured Sakaar. Or seeing it into an office state. He controls all the world's criminal elements. He is the cause of the rise in global crime rate. Are you sure you want a criminal like that on board a star cruiser like that up there? The Predestar. Only one way to find out. He's in there. Thank you. We're all here in this mess because of you! It's your fault! All of it! All of it! Bruh, I thought she was in a coma for a year. I was. But how does he know you? I don't know.
Ricardo, he knows him. Ricardo, he knew him. Derosis is not even classified. I know. And bullet throw. How does he do it? Are you tripping right now? Eh, we all are at this rate. We're going on board the Predestar. Who knows how much things were different then? You trust them? Derosis, Saran? I trust Trelk. Drotes kills that game Derosis. While questioning the way things turn out. Bullet throw can throw and put the bullets like a dart. Never would I have thought of such a talent. We depart in ten minutes. I have the docking coordinates Derosis gave me. He's not listening. He won't listen. You know how many want and have tried to seize the Predestar? And with Rectomancer on board? There's only one way these scenarios end. And usually, they don't end well.